Imagine a cosmic object that defies our understanding of the universe, reversing what we know about gravity itself. Welcome to the mysterious world of white holes. Often we find ourselves captivated by the enigmatic allure of black holes, their awe-inspiring gravitational pull that devours everything in its path, even light itself. Yet, on the other side of this cosmic coin lies a lesser-known, more elusive entity. The white hole. White holes, as their name suggests, are the theoretical opposites of black holes, where black holes absorb all matter and light that cross their event horizon, white holes are thought to do the exact opposite. They are cosmic objects that, instead of pulling everything in, push everything out. They are the celestial rebels, defying the gravitational norm and challenging our understanding of the cosmos. But just as a coin has two sides, so does our understanding of these cosmic phenomena. Black holes are widely accepted in the scientific community, their existence supported by numerous observations and data. White holes, on the other hand, remain largely theoretical, their existence yet to be proven. They are mathematical curiosities, born from Einstein's theory of general relativity, yet absent in the realm of observational evidence. But what if these elusive white holes do exist? What if, Hidden in the depths of the cosmos, there are cosmic bodies that defy our understanding of gravity, spewing out matter and light instead of sucking it in. The mere prospect is enough to ignite our curiosity, to inspire us to delve deeper into the enigma of white holes. An antithesis to the black hole, a white hole, forces us to question our understanding of the cosmos. But what exactly is a white hole? Stick around as we delve deeper into this cosmic mystery. Hello, my name is Andrew and welcome to my channel. If you're as fascinated by space and its enigmatic wonders as I am, you're in the right place. To ensure you don't miss out on our cosmic explorations, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and give this video a like if you find it intriguing. So let's dive into today's topic. A white hole, in simple terms, is a theoretical celestial body predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity. This theory, which revolutionized our understanding of gravity, also gave birth to the concept of black holes and their less famous counterparts, white holes. Like a mirror image of a black hole, a white hole is characterized by its reverse gravitational pull. So, while a black hole is a region of space-time exhibiting gravitational acceleration so strong that nothing not even particles and electromagnetic radiation such as light can escape from it. A white hole is quite the opposite. Imagine, if you will, a cosmic object that instead of devouring everything that comes near it, ejects matter and light, almost like a cosmic geyser. This is essentially what a white hole is thought to be. It's a region of the universe where matter and light spontaneously spring forth. While black holes are like cosmic vacuum cleaners, tirelessly sucking in everything that comes too close. White holes are the cosmic spitballs of the universe, spewing out matter and energy. They are the time-reversed counterparts of black holes, expelling matter and light outward instead of pulling it in. It's a fascinating concept, isn't it? But you might be wondering, where does this idea come from? Well, it's all about the mathematics of Einstein's theory of general relativity. The origins of white holes lie in the mathematical equations of black holes and the concept of space-time curvature. Now, the story of white holes begins with their darker siblings, black holes. Black holes, as we've come to understand, are regions of space-time where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape. They're like cosmic vacuum cleaners, gobbling up everything in their path. But what if we reverse this concept what if there was a cosmic object that, instead of sucking everything in, spat everything out? Enter the theoretical white hole. White holes are mathematically derived from black holes, but they behave in the exact opposite manner. They're predicted by the equations of Einstein's theory of general relativity, the same equations that predicted the existence of black holes. While a black hole is a region of space-time from which nothing can escape, a white hole is a region of space-time from which nothing can enter. 
you might be wondering, how does this happen? Well, to understand that, we need to delve into the concept of space-time curvature. According to general relativity, massive objects like stars and planets curve the fabric of space-time around them. This curvature is what we perceive as gravity. Now imagine if you could bend this fabric so much that it folds onto itself, creating a tunnel between two points in space-time. This is the concept of a wormhole. Some theories suggest that at one end of this wormhole, there's a black hole absorbing matter, and at the other end, there's a white hole spewing out this matter into a completely different region of space-time, or perhaps even a different universe. So, in essence, white holes are like the mirror image of a black hole, the yin to the black hole's yang. But if they exist, why haven't we seen one? The reality is, white holes are elusive. To date, we have no empirical evidence of their existence. The very nature of white holes makes them difficult to observe. Unlike their dark counterparts, which are detectable by their gravitational effects on surrounding matter and light, white holes are theorized to expel matter and light, making them theoretically visible, but practically elusive. Now, why is that the case? It's because white holes, in theory, are highly unstable. They would likely collapse into black holes if they were to exist. This instability, coupled with the fact that they contradict the second law of thermodynamics, which mandates that entropy must always increase, makes their existence in the real universe highly improbable. Yet, the universe is vast and mysterious, and we've been surprised before. Some physicists have proposed that certain phenomena like gamma ray bursts could be manifestations of white holes. These are incredibly bright, short-lived events that we've observed in distant galaxies. Could they be the result of a white hole event? The idea is tantalizing, but as of now, it remains pure speculation. There's also the hypothesis that the Big Bang itself was a white hole event. This theory suggests that our universe might have been born from the matter ejected by a white hole. Again, a fascinating concept, but one without concrete evidence. In the realm of the theoretical, white holes could be connected to phenomena like wormholes. The idea is that matter falling into a black hole in one universe could be ejected through a white hole into another universe. It's a mind-boggling concept that sounds straight out of a science fiction novel. While we've yet to catch a white hole in the act, the possibilities they present are intriguing. Despite the lack of observational evidence, the theoretical existence of white holes continues to challenge our understanding of the cosmos, encouraging us to delve deeper into the mysteries of the universe. White holes could play a role in phenomena like wormholes, time travel, and even the birth of universes. The speculative applications of these theoretical celestial bodies are as fascinating as they are perplexing. Picture this, a wormhole, a tunnel in the fabric of space-time connecting a black hole and a white hole. Matter plunges into the black hole, travels through the wormhole, and is violently ejected through the white hole. Could this be a way for matter to teleport across vast cosmic distances? Or maybe even a doorway to another universe? Imagine time travel, a concept often relegated to the realm of science fiction. If white holes can reverse the gravitational pull of black holes, could they also reverse the flow of time? While this idea is purely speculative and faces numerous theoretical hurdles, it's a tantalizing thought that stirs our collective imagination. And then there's the birth of universes. Some physicists propose that the Big Bang, the event that gave birth to our universe, might have been a white hole event, an explosive emission of matter and energy that sparked the creation of everything we know. But with all these speculative applications come a host of unanswered questions. Where does the matter ejected by a white hole come from? Could it be from a black hole in a parallel universe? And if white holes really can reverse time, what does that mean for our understanding of causality and the arrow of time? As of now, these questions remain unresolved, fueling ongoing research efforts in the world of astrophysics. This elusive concept, the white hole, challenges our understanding of the universe 
and propels us to push the boundaries of our knowledge. The existence of white holes may remain a mystery, but the questions they raise push the boundaries of our understanding.